Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how can you know how much texture resolution you need for your 3D models. So why am I doing this video? Uh, the reason is many people ask how much texel density do I need for my game or my project and the answers are always along the lines of it depends uh, it depends on the kind of project, uh, how much, uh, how big is the object, how small is the object, and they really don't give an exact answer, like, hey, just tell me a number, how much do I need, do I need 1k texture, do I need 2k textures, uh, should I go 4k and then down res uh, the texture, and the answer, of course, is uh, always, it depends. Uh, luckily for us, we have a way in our real engine to check how much texture resolution we need for our objects. So here I am in this Blueprint Office scene, which you can download free uh, in the real launcher. Um, I have all these 3D models and I want to know how much texture resolution I need. If I'm going to high, I'm going to lose performance. If I'm going to low, uh, the game is not going to look good. So you can say like if you really zoom in, the textures start to get in blurry. As you zoom out, they get in sharper. So you don't need to eyeball this. I mean, there is a better way. Uh, I'm going to show you how. If you here in the viewport view modes, uh, there is this optimization view view modes. If if you click on required texture resolution, you will have this scene, which doesn't show us anything. What this will do is, once I click on an object, let's say this floor, and I want to see the textures it's using, I can click here and I can see the list of textures that the 3D object is using. Let's say I want to check the wood texture. Now I have some information. And what I have here is, uh, it's white, if it's good, if it's green, then the texture resolution is too high. And if it's red, the texture resolution is too low. So, how much texture resolution do you need? Again, it depends on the game you're making. Let's say you are having a first person game, first person shooter, uh, then this might be okay. But if you are having like a real time strategy game and you have like a camera here, uh, this texture resolution is just too much. So, how can you, how can you know how much texture resolution you need? Uh, it's very simple. If I click here and check uh, the wood texture, uh, I'll open this. So it says it's a 2K texture, okay? But this is just too much from uh, from this this camera distance, and it really depends on the screen percentage that your object is using. If I really zoom in, it starts to get uh, really blurry. If I zoom out, uh, it gets really sharp. So the way you want to handle this is if you type max here, you have this maximum texture size. Let's say I'm using 256, uh, 128 texture. Uh, really extreme example. But if you see this, the texture resolution is fine. Uh, from this angle, it's acceptable. So if I click on lead mode, this, this looks uh, just as fine uh, as the 2K texture. But if I really zoom in, this will get blurry. If I go to the require texture resolution view mode again and check my wood texture 
you can see that this is red so it's really just a way to uh, check how much texture resolution you need you can go really low as, as 128 pixels and if your camera won't be re, uh, won't be uh, summoning a, a lot of adjects like if it's a first person game yeah, it's going to be fine so this is a great way to find uh, how much texture resolution you need for your projects if I go to 2k here you can see uh, the viewer automatically uh, refreshes uh, the texture resolution required so if I go to lead mode now if I zoom in I, I have a really sharp uh, texture but it's really uh, not necessarily if I'm going to view this texture from this angle and the great thing about this is that you, you can check all the textures uh, using the scene for instance if I go here again uh, let's check another one uh, probably this one uh, you can see not only this object but a lot of objects are using the same texture so you're really saving a lot of texture space uh, by doing this so uh, I hope this video has been useful to you uh, it helps a lot especially when you want to know how much texture resolution you need uh, when you are optimizing your game so uh, I hope you like this video thanks a lot